Well, one of the biggest problems I think we have right now is a sense of complacency that's crept in, and complacency is a luxury we can't afford. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I started as Homeland Security Secretary and uh, obviously was never a counterterrorism expert, but I learned a lot along the way. And at the end of the day, I think we need Americans to understand they're strategic actors, they're patient. They don't set their watches like you and I do according to a Western timetable. We're still in the crosshairs, and uh, complacency is not a... Uh, well, you're right about this, and I want to get to that, because yeah. this is important, sure. because I think we are now in a pre- 9-11 mindset. I think Barack Obama is weakening this country and making it vulnerable. And I'll get your thoughts on it. I just, I just wish is we would Barack have done Obama it differently. Is bringing this country to a pre-9-11 mentality? Well, I worry about the sense of complacency. I worry about when your attorney general is saying that the men who were responsible for interrogating in the aftermath of the horror of 9-11 are now be investigated potentially by a special prosecutor. They were told they should do it. They were well, told they could do it under the law, and they did it. Governor, thank you. They're wrong. Appreciate it. Thank we you. Got a lot more to get to when we come back. The controversy over the UN teaching masturbation to five-year-olds. Straight ahead.